And next on Video Jug, we're passing live to How to Boost Your Karma. Thanks, Martin. Hello, and welcome to Video Jug. Tremendous atmosphere developing for this game, which sees 25 year old Danny Capstan battling with his own moral life over an eight hour period. Jeff? Yes, thanks, Dave. Of course, what Danny will have to bear in mind today is with karma, you can't predict when your actions will come full circle. That's right, Jeff. Call it what you want causality, reaping what you sow. It all boils down to the same thing. In this game, the good and bad you do will come back to you at a later stage. Well, Dave, I can confirm that Danny has been plugged into the karmarometer, so it won't be long now. And we're off! Looks like Danny's found his way to the cash machine and he's ordered himself a tenner. What do you think he's going to spend that tenner on? Maybe a circus? I think he'll probably just go for a pizza. I like Hawaiian myself. What's this? This isn't a tenner, this is a twenty. Check out the karma meter. That is all over the place. Looks like he's taking the whole lot. He's going to be a rich man. Surely he's not just going to run away with all of that money? It looks like he is, Jeff. It looks like he is. My God, Dave, this is Carmageddon. Almost immediately, Danny's faced with another choice. This is going to be a real test of his karma, this one. That looks like a pound to me, Dave. A small, tiny, golden pound. He might as well have given him a kick in the face. Hold on a minute. I think Danny's had a bit of a change of heart. And what's this? Look, there's a 20 in his hand. I think he's going for it. There it is. That's some good karma right there. Look at that homeless man. He's as happy as a cat with a ball of wool for a hand. Let's see that in an instant replay. So, Dave, how do you think this action is going to reflect his karma? Well, I think if you uh, watch it carefully, Jeff, you'll see that it's not just going to negate the bad karma from his previous actions, but it's actually going to put him in the plus. So what's going on here, Dave? Danny's at his desk, and I think he's working on a project with his colleague, Gordon. I've always had a bit of a soft spot for Gordon myself. Is that him there? That's him there. He is lovely. And it looks like they're going to hand in the project right now. That's true, but whereabouts is Gordon? He's not there, Jeff. It looks like he's taking all the credit for himself. That's right, Dave. That's exactly what he's doing. What a scoundrel! Yes, you're quite right, Jeff. His karma is dropping off rapidly, but it looks like he's bumped into Gordon again. Gordon's just given him some cake to celebrate, unaware that Danny's stabbed him in the back with a karma knife. Karma cake all round! Gordon's gift seems to have had some effect on Danny's conscience. Let's see how this develops. And there he is. Danny's taken him to see the boss, and he's giving him some credit. Karma is rocketing back up. That must have been some bloody good cake. Danny's enjoying a rum and Coca-Cola with his best mate, Ron. Who's that girl? That's no gatecrasher. That's Ron's girlfriend, Jeff. She is lovely. She is that, Jeff. And I think Danny agrees with you. What's happening now, Dave? It looks like he's getting a phone call. Yes, it looks like Ron's being called away on urgent business. And what's this? Danny is making a move on his best friend's girl. Wow, he's swinging in like an eagle on a zip line. That's fast. And it's making the karma meter go crazy. Right in the kisser, Dave! Rewind, I want to see that one more time. That's right, Dave, he's practically up to the throat in karma juices. I'd let a spit in my mouth, Jeff. In this slow-mo, you can really see the karma. That's devastating, but it does mean his karma meter's back to zero. I guess he had it coming. Hey, there's somebody new in the picture, who the hell's that? You haven't been doing your research, have you, Jeff? Not so much. That's Alicia's sister, Sarah. Danny's behaving himself again. He's making amends and I think he's buying the drinks. Danny plays a blinder and gives her the drink he's just bought for himself. He's made a good start here. That's right, Jeff. And judging by her pupils, it looks like she wants a piece of him. Woo woo! It's the karma train! It's the karma train! Choo choo, choo choo. Jeff, it looks like they've really hit it off. Look, they're off for a walk in the park, holding hands and everything. His karma meter is right up there at the moment. Do you know, I don't think anything can touch this kid right now. He's even keeping his good karma topped up by picking up some litter. What's this here? Oh, look at that! Did you see that, Dave? Did you see that? Danny took him down with one fell swoop. I didn't think burglars really dressed like that, Jeff. Well, I guess that's the thing about karma, Dave. Even a little thing like picking up some litter can make you a hero. I'm just a little bit puzzled, though, Jeff. What about that money that he stole earlier? Oh! Well, I guess that answers that question. Better luck next time, Danny. Knock, knock, Dave. Who's there? Karma. Yeah, yeah, good one, Jeff. Jeff, seriously, do you have to always shout? Yes, Dave!